What's up, the John Squad? This is John Pilling here, your YouTube world. That's a champion here on YouTube, and I'm coming to and I'm coming at you today. My WWE Monday Night Raw review for March fifth, two thousand and eighteen. So let's get things going, shall we? We kicked off the Monday Night Raw with Kurt Angle, and he talks about last week and. And uh, it went too far last week when Triple H punched him, uh, you know, sucker punched him in the mouth, uh, you know, punched him out. So then he calls out Triple H, but instead it, it becomes out Stephanie McMahon. So Stephanie McMahon comes out and tells him that Triple H is not here tonight. So then, so then Ronda Rousey comes out and talks about last week and that she's dealing with um, mean bosses. So then the person, so then the person Ronda Rousey chooses to fight at Wrestlemania 34, she reveals her opponent, and she, and they do a little bit of a drum roll, she chooses to fight Stephanie McMahon at Wrestlemania 34, but wait, there's more to this segment, so then Triple H comes out, and Kurt Angle's like, wait, I thought you weren't here, so then he tries to get Kurt Angle to change, so then Kurt Angle makes a match for Wrestlemania 34, he makes him he makes him and Ronda Rousey versus Triple H and Stephanie McMahon at WrestleMania 34, a, a mixed tag team challenge match. So that's what happens there. So then, what happens is that Triple H and Kurt Angle start to brawl it out, and then they start to brawl it out, and then Ron, Stephanie McMahon attacks Ronda Rousey from behind, and then and then. Um, Statement backs away and things just happened here and the whole segment just started went out of loop and then Kurt Angle and Ronda Rousey stand, stand tall to end that segment. So the first match we had on Raw was Asuka versus Nia Jax and the winner was Asuka. The second match we had on Raw was The Revival versus Cesaro and Sheamus and the winner was Cesaro and Sheamus. So then we had an in-ring promo on Raw with John Cena and he talks about that he is here tonight on Raw to talk about to talk about SmackDown because he found his road to WrestleMania and talks about the six pack challenge match that's taking place at Fastlane this Sunday. And and so at Fastlane that there will be a record broken and that he will become a seventeen time champion at Fastlane. So that's what he says, that there will be a seventeen time that he will become a seventeen time champion and break Rick Player's record and walk into WrestleMania as a champion. So then he tells AJ Styles to use his rematch clause right away and make it be a triple threat match for him versus Shinsuke Nakamura versus John Cena versus AJ Styles. So that's what he tells him to do. So then Goldust comes out and tells him that he is going to stop John Cena's road to WrestleMania, and then Goldust sucker punches John Cena. So then we have ourselves a match. So the third match in the row was Goldust versus John Cena, and the winner was John Cena. You can't see me. That's right, John Cena was the winner. The next match you had on Raw was Bailey versus Mandy Rose, and the winner was Bailey. After the match, Absolution beat down on Bailey. Then Sasha Banks makes the save. The fifth match you had on Raw was um the fifth match you had on Raw was um a Symphony of Destruction match we had was Elias who wants to walk with Elias versus Braun Strowman, and the winner was Braun Strowman. Then another match you had on Raw was Bray Wyatt versus Rhino? And the winner was Bray Wyatt, of course. After the match, Bray Wyatt cuts a promo. And then Matt Hardy appears on the Titan Tron. And does, uh, do, delete, delete. Matt Hardy appears on the Titan Tron. And then, he admit, and then he says that if he wants to fight Bray Wyatt, he can come and fight him at the Hardy Compound. Wow, that's awesome right there. So that means now we had the Mizzy third annual Mizzy Awards, and the first award that Miz gives out is to Seth Rollins and Finn Balor, and he says that they're not here to accept these awards because they are not here. So then on to the next one. Then he gives out the second Mizzy Award to none other than Kurt Angle. So that's who he gives out the award to. But then Seth Rollins comes out, and also so does Finn Balor, and the Miz challenges Seth Rollins and Finn Balor to a three on. Two handicap match. So then another match you had on row was a three on two handicap match. Seth Rollins and 
Uh, Finn Balor versus The Miz and The Miz Trash. And the winner was Seth Rollins and Finn Balor. That's right. Seth Rollins and Finn Balor picked up the win. After the match, Kurt Angle comes out and announces that Miz's WrestleMania opponents are going to be Seth Rollins versus Finn Balor versus The Miz for the Intercontinental Championship at WrestleMania 34. So then... The final part we had on Raw was Paul Heyman, and he did, and he delivers a message on behalf of Brock Lesnar, and that after Brock Lesnar retains his Universal Title on April 8th at WrestleMania, that he will lay down the Universal Title Championship in the middle of the ring and the UFC title, which there's been rumors of Brock Lesnar going back to the UFC title and talks about Roman Reigns beating The Undertaker at last year's WrestleMania and stuff like that, and then he talks about beating Brock Lesnar, and that next week on Raw, Heyman will bring Brock Lesnar. So then, Heyman says that the title needs Roman. So then, he says that Raw and that Brock Lesnar will be here on Raw. So then Roman Reigns comes out and cuts a promo to Paul Heyman and says, this is what I'm talking about to all the Milwaukee fans. That's what he says that. And this is that uh, next week, make sure you bring Brock Lesnar and that we are going to have a fight and make sure he's not dressed in his street clothes or anything, that we are going to have a fight and we are going to go face to face. So that's what happens there. So that means they're going to go face to face next Monday on Raw in Detroit. Woo! Gonna shape up to be a fight there in Detroit. So, anyway, it is Hockey Town in Detroit. So, they're gonna be in the Little Caesar Arena. So, can't wait to see that next Monday. So, once again, the John Squad, please like this video. Tap that bell on the YouTube app saying, Number says, Upload all my videos. I'll wait two seconds. Okay, goody. Tap that bell on your YouTube app. Awesome. So, once again, the John Squad, please like this video. Leave your comments down below what you thought about today Monday Night Raw last night. And subscribe for more. You're all the best of John Squad. You're all one of a kind. Love each and every single one of you all. Peace out, the John Squad. I love each and every one of you guys. We're all champions here on this channel.